It's 2024, and what better way to start the year than talking about Nintendo Switch 2? And I know there's some of you out there that like to laugh about this because of how much we talk about it. Ha ha ha! What if it doesn't even come out this year? And what if you're just going to be made to look like a fool, Mr. Nintendo Prime? And look, you could absolutely be right. It's not like I work at Nintendo and get to make these sort of decisions. But today is not that day. Today is a day where I actually get backed up on my opinion that Nintendo Switch 2 is coming out this year and we should be really excited for it because some game developers are now publicly talking about Nintendo Switch 2 coming this year. Like, really excited for this system to come out. This is, like, real stories. I'm so, oh, man, I'm so happy about this. I'm, we got to give credit first to Mr. Andres Restart. He uh, brought this to my attention yesterday, actually. We talked on the phone about it, but I was going to let him do his research and do his video and see if it was worth talking about. And it is because we got guys from like Capcom and Koei Tecmo, Japanese developers, all but confirming that Nintendo Switch 2 is coming this year. So uh, we got to get into this because they are really, really excited about it. And I'm really excited about what they had to say. So while I was giving credit to Andres Restart, we also need to make sure we give credit to where this information came from. And that is a fan of Andres Restart's channel called Something Else. He's got a Twitter account, and this is where he got a hold of Andres in order to share some information. Now, where do all these developer quotes come from? Well, two places. First, we have Famitsu Magazine, right? It's this interview right here. It, it was directly translated uh, by the Google thing, but that's not actually where the translations came from. But that wasn't the only place. Uh, the other place is actually none other than gamer.net and an interview on this website. So uh, that is really, really awesome. Now, the translations were all done through a piece of software known as Deep L. This is a very common translation software. It is considered widely considered one of the best in the world. But we're actually going to head on over to the thread that contains the information. So here we go. Something else, as I said here, this at Clean Green 23 got a hold of Andres. You can see he did it publicly here. And if you scroll down, let's just get to the actual translated part because he did this for Andres. Here are the four quotes from Famitsu slash 4Gamer. Capcom's Masa Kawada. I, look, I'm just going to go by the company's name because I'm really bad at pronouncing names. 2024 will also bring new consoles and more indie titles to look forward to. A person from Koei Tecmo said, this is pretty direct, Nintendo's new platform has been the focus of much attention. Koei Tecmo, another employee there, said, we look forward to seeing what new gaming platforms and their titles will bring to the table. And then from Spike Chunsoft, we see there are rumors of a new Switch, and I'm looking forward to seeing what kind of machine it will be. Now, look, all these companies have dev kits, and they are definitely under NDA. So they can't give us, like, exact details. They can't technically even confirm it's coming this year, but they can comment on public rumors and public reports, and that's what they're doing here. They're talking about what they're excited for in 2024. Just to put this in perspective, all of this was all them talking about what they're excited for in 2024. Uh, and you have people from Koei Tecmo directly saying Nintendo's new platform has been the focus of much attention for them. Uh, you obviously have, you know, Capcom out there. 2024 brings new consoles and more indie titles to look forward to. Guys, they're clearly talking about Nintendo Nintendo Switch 2. I mean, one comment is specifically talking about whatever this next generation Nintendo thing is called. This is so exciting because up until now, we've been reliant on conversations around Switch 2 to come from insiders, right? We've had to, you know, listen to people like Nate the Hate or Andy Robinson. And while these people are credible or pretty credible, especially Andy Robinson, the thing is we haven't been able to really put actual developers to task, right? Like, where's this information coming from, this inside information? And now we have companies making public statements, actual employees, about Nintendo's next platform. Yes, folks, it's coming. It's coming. If this isn't, like, the biggest sign that we're getting Nintendo Switch 2 this year, then I don't know what you're paying attention to. You want to live in denial land, live in your denial land. I can't do anything about it. But now we have literally developers, public-facing names, 
saying things about the new system heading into 2024. Come on now. They're not doing that if this thing isn't coming out. These people would already have the dev kits. So I find that to be utterly fascinating. And look, we are still don't know when this thing's coming out, right? We, we have no idea. There's a lot of speculation out there. Some people think it's going to be teased even this month. We had a Zuby Tech rumor for that. But people just think in general, maybe it's, if it's going to be an early like a first six month release, like it's going to release by June. They would maybe do a tease right now, a blowout event in March or April, and then they release the dang thing. Uh, or it won't, won't be revealed till summer because they're going to do a more fall release, like October, September, uh, maybe even November. So it'll be interesting to see when Nintendo times this thing to come out. But man, developers are excited about this thing heading into next year. And, or wait, <laughs> I still can't get over it. Heading into this year, heading into 2024, these developers are stupidly excited. And so am I. I mean, I've been hyping it responsibly for over a month now, and I am just ready, man. I'm so ready. Look, we got titles coming out the butt. We got you know, possible launch games like 3D Mario or a Metroid Prime 4 or a Mario Kart. I have no idea. I don't know. Luigi's Metro 4. I, look, I don't know what Nintendo's bringing. I just know that I'm ready for it. And so are these developers. Now, I want to give you a prediction quick just on what I think is going to happen. I do think Nintendo is going to tease the system this month. We're going to get one of those October 2016 style teaser trailers, which is a reveal, right? They're, that's revealing the system this month. Then I think in March, yeah, probably March, we're going to have the blowout event, right? This, that's the January 2017 thing where they get people together in a room. They do this whole big giant presentation on it. It's like an hour long. Yes, I think that's happening this March. And then I think this damn thing's arriving in May. Uh, look, I, I know that's still like five months from now. It might feel like forever. But that gives them a little three, four, five month run up to really market the hell out of this. Also, it lets all it kind of clears out their first part of the year slate of games, right? They already know what uh, what these games are going to be, like Princess Peach Showtime. It also lines them up with enough time to still throw a Nintendo Direct in there, where there's going to be even more game announcements, both for Switch and Nintendo Switch 2. And we got to remember, Nintendo's been clarifying over the last year with their Directs. If you look at the title of their Directs, they now say Nintendo Switch in the title of the Directs. Again, why is that? Well, probably because there's directs this year that will be focused on Switch and or extra ones that are focused just on the next system or ones that do both. So now they got to clarify and label the directs. That is something, again, credit to Andres Restart that he noticed over the past year Nintendo started doing when they weren't doing this in the first six years of the Nintendo Switch's life. So I don't know, guys. This is pretty interesting to me. That's all I'm going to say. So guys... It's the first day of 2024, and we have the closest thing we're going to get outside of Nintendo announcing it to direct confirmation that this is the year for Nintendo's next generation. All right, folks. I'm Nintendo Rubble Jazz from Nintendo Prime. I want to thank you so much for being here. Catch you in the next video.